What's up everybody? We're gonna change the oil in the razor today. Got uh, Polaris's oil change kit. Part number 2879323. What do we get? We get oil filter. Two and a half quarts of full synthetic pre-measured oil for you. And a new crush washer, whatever you want to call it, for your drain plug. Take a six millimeter Allen, pull the drain plug, let's uh, get under the machine. Right here is your drain plug hole. I'm gonna clean some of the dirt out of here. Just cause. And my machine's pretty dirty. It's not like super clean. From our Talzma trip, if you haven't seen those videos, you can go watch them, but I put my safety glasses on cause I've only got two eyeballs. That's all I'll ever get. And I don't want a bunch of dirt or something falling in my eye cause that would be lame. So, six millimeter Allen. Pop that loose. My catch pan under here. Pretty clean looking, huh? I don't have a lot of miles on this. I think I've only got, I don't know, 50 miles or so. Probably just under that, actually. And then uh, not a lot of hours either, but I've had this machine for a while. I just haven't gotten to drive it as much as I would like to. So, um, changing the oil before we go to... Moab. Um, I don't really see any gunk on the plug there. That kerplop that we heard I think was my crush washer. Yeah, that's what it was right here. Still probably in fine shape, but we're going to use the new one anyway. They gave us one. Well, they didn't give it to us. Let's be real. I paid for it, but... Let all the oil drain, I'll go up top and open the fill. Let some air on the top side and get all this oil out. Pull this cover out, oil fill. Open him. And then we'll just let all that oil drain in. All right, so now we're gonna I'm just down to like a random drip out the bottom here. I'm gonna get this oil filter off if I can. And I don't have an oil filter wrench this size, so. So it's all right. When you're taking the old one out, because I'm not going to reuse it. down in the pan there. Take the rag. And let's clean that. 
ceiling surface off a little bit. Looks pretty good. Sweet. All right. So what I'm doing now, I'm gonna take the new oil filter and I'm just gonna get my finger with a little bit of fresh oil and just put a small, small coat on this gasket. Ceiling surface, whatever you wanna call it. Clean my hands off. Try not to spill oil all over the garage floor. Freaking sweet, wouldn't it? Just get that started. Do it until you feel it seat. And then just turn it till it's freaking snug by hand. You don't need to get wild with that thing. No reason for that. And there's a fresh oil filter. And then get this started. I think we're in trouble. 